Just give me a little bit of peace. A steady job and some food to eat. Just give me a little bit of peace. A steady job and some food to eat. Just give me a little bit of peace. Got a brother on the line who's currently working on a documentary about his life story. And he's here to share a little bit of it with us. Ladies and gentlemen, on the line from Five Deuce Hoover Gangster Crip in Tennessee, I have Lamont. What up, Lamont? What's going on, man? How you doing? Oh, Shout doing out good. to Dusty Vision, man. Thank you, homie. Thank you. I appreciate you once again joining the program and sharing your story with us. Yeah, man, for sure. Well, let's... Uh, appreciate let's, you, man. Thank you, homie. Thank you. Uh, let's take it all the way back, man. Way, way back. Um, where did you grow up? Well, I grew up on the east side of Nashville, Tennessee, man, originally. Um, yeah, all through the east side, man. Later came out uh, after doing the long bid, seven years. Mm. Came out with family, L.A., you know. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's even go back a little bit further, you know, before you you – I guess, quote unquote, jumped off the porch or whatnot. Who were some of the gangs, if there were any, you know, present really in the Nashville area before Crips and Bloods made an appearance? There were there really wasn't any gangs back in the day, man. I mean, you had certain cats going against each other. Uh, east side may go against the west side, vice versa, or south side or whatever, man. It really wasn't any any gangs. Uh, back in the day, man, at all. You know, no official gang where, you know, you had members. So it was basically a lot of cats who primarily grew up with each other in the same neighborhoods or whatever. That, but that was it before the Crips and Bloods. Okay. And what about you? What was your upbringing like back then? You know, was mom around, dad around? Mom was around, you know, which you normally have. <laughs> it's crazy that it, in some places that's the norm, but that's what it is, man. I grew up in a single family home. Uh, I didn't meet my pops until I was like 11 years old. Uh, and I probably didn't see him no more after that for like four years. But yeah, just grew up. My mom's, my grandmother raised me, rest in peace. Uh, that's it, man. You know, I was a uh, only child. You know, grew up on the east side of Nashville, man. My upbringing was was basic, man. You know, grew up in the project. You know, grew up in what's considered, you know, uh, low income area. And, you know, went to school, dropped out of school, man, at a young age. And started getting into life of crime, man. Probably around 14 or 15. Okay. Well, to the best of your knowledge, when did Crips and Bloods, you know, first make an appearance? When, I guess when's the first time you ever even heard of Crips and Bloods? Well, before I answer that question, man, I'm going to say this, man, you know, and no disrespect and no shade on uh, nobody, man. But from my recollection, man, and I can say that for a fact because I was present, that the first time I ever seen or heard of any Crips, um, like 1986, 1987 in Nashville, man. And back then, cats wasn't gang banging. You know, you just had a, a lot of affiliates that would come down to Nashville, man, and do their thing, you know, from L.A. But yeah, definitely, the 107s, Underground, the first gang that I seen with my own eyes. And then start, other gangs started to come down a couple of years after that. Okay. And you mentioned um, offline that you were actually present when the first 107 UGCs were put on. Is that correct? Yeah, I, I was in the pen with the uh, the very first Nashville. Um, let's make that clear. Yeah, the yeah. Nashville member was put on by LA 107 UGCs, man. Yeah, I was in the pen present right there when it all took place. That was in 1992. I, I came off the porch with this gang thing, man, back in uh, September of 1990, man. Mm. You know, being the first member in Tennessee um, that ever claimed and represented, you know, that was known, um, you know, 
again, you might have some cats to try to dispute that, but they can't because the truth is the truth, you know? See the city bus. She don't want to ride the city bus. Because she's new to the town, I advise Look for truth, there is a lost in the sound Brains are lost in the cloud, dead from all of the smoke That's the reason why the ostrich hides his head in the ground That's the reason why the monster even puts on a mask And we turn the city green to blend in with the grass The city scene made a crash, I fell in love with it twice Had to tell her goodbye cause she fell in love with the night I couldn't keep up, I tried to bring it down from the sky But the clouds were so nice that she took a nap for a while And when she woke up, I finally had a kid and a lady Bone told me saw the other day with the baby ain't life crazy i think about it once in a while when it's cloudy outside and the sun goes none of these drugs do what they supposed to yeah and what's the point of hurting people that you're close to yeah most of my life i've been following stars knowing i ain't really had to go that far come to find out is the truth i already know yeah Spinning out a cylinder, moving, I'm in reverse Committing crimes of passion, judging jury at first But I love that girl, been my woman since day one Had a couple of kids in the house, the job done So what happened while we ain't loving no more? Maybe I should take some blame instead of taking the score But me and more don't go, I'm begging you gotta change We can work it out even through pleasure and pain You gotta chill with the liquor girl, you get too friendly Who you talking to baby, that's my man Henry That's what I'm talking about baby, just sit your ass Damn. You wanted to have some fun, me take you out on the town So you can shake a tail feather, maybe we cut a rug Drinking and driving on the low key, rum in a jug Give me a hug, wrong nigga baby You drive your nigga crazy in the morning Won't remember shit, I know it's kinda hazy None of these drugs do what they supposed to Yeah And what's the point of hurting people that you're close to Yeah most of my life I've been following stars Knowing I ain't really had to go that far Come to find out it's the truth I already know Yeah Ready, ready, set, go. go. Put your seatbelt on, up in the way we bout to go. We bout to the go. road is gon' get windy, promise not to lose control. Yeah. The final destination's bound to captivate your soul. And so, so, many MCs inspired to be one of the baddest motherfuckers to touch the MIC. Then the law came life, now we dreams deferred. All the years of writing rhymes capturing the blur.